and for everyone involved. It's safe for me to relax into complete forgiveness. It's safe for me to feel these feelings completely as they arise and release them immediately. I know that I have the strength to completely acknowledge these feelings and process them immediately as they come up. And I give myself total permission to release anything that no longer serves me. And that it's safe now for me to relax into the bigness of who I am and what I have to offer in this world. <sighs> it's safe now. It's safe now for me to apply this new energy to other amazing projects that I'm working on. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's safe now for me to let go of these last remaining energies from my body. It's just leftover patterns of energy, of thinking that I'm too small or that I can't do it. Uh, yeah, yeah. These weren't even my patterns in the first place. I just picked these up by existing in this world. I feel excited to forgive myself and every person who's ever had this feeling that they were too much for the world to handle and so made themselves small. Ooh. I am open <laughs> to releasing any part of me that feels like I need to be small. I am open to releasing this leftover energy in my body. And I'm open to letting this energy, accepting this energy. I'm just gonna bring acceptance to this energy. It's dissipated a lot, but there's like this level four that's like stuck in the front of my rib cage. So I'm just bringing attention I just love and accept this energy that's here right now in the front of my rib cage. I just accept it where it is. It's okay that it's here. It might even be here for the rest of my life. And I just accept it. It's okay. It's okay that I have this feeling of anger at myself for holding on. It's okay that I have this anger at myself for not letting go already. It's totally okay this feeling of anger at myself 
and that society for making smoking okay. Oh. Oh. <sighs> it's okay for me to let go of this from my body even though there's still smokers in this world who are suffering. It's okay. It's okay that it's still in the world. And it's safe for me to let it go from my body now. And it's okay that it's still in my body at a level two now. I love and accept this feeling of anger at the still existing in the world for other people in their suffering. I completely accept this feeling at a level two in my body. I still love and accept myself. I love and accept myself. I love and accept myself. Ooh. Okay, now I'm tapping over my whole body. Erin, you have such courage to keep quitting smoking. You're on your way to being a full-time breather of fresh air. I love and admire your courage to tape this and put it in for the public to see and let people see what they think might be crazy. I love your courage for doing that in the world. You're totally amazing. And I love you. You're amazing. And I love you for your courage and willingness to face everything head on and address these patterns, allowing yourself to stand bigger in the world. Okay, shaking. <sighs> okay, that feels pretty good. I feel kind of a buzzing and like waves of energy moving through my body. Uh, I'm still at like a one or a two, just a little bit of anxiousness left over. I'm okay with that. That's totally legit. I don't feel like I need to cry anymore. I feel like that moved what I was feeling and I totally had that insight uh, that I didn't want to let go of this feeling even though I let go of smoking because other people are still suffering uh, which uh, I feel like finding compassion for myself for that's really easy because it comes from a place of really deeply loving the world which is also why I'm letting you see me in my messy state because I love you I love all of us and I'm so excited for us to accept and love ourselves more completely. <sighs> okay. God, that even feels even better. I'm down to like a one, hardly anything. <sighs> I hope you have an amazing day. Uh, and if you need support, um, tech, check out uh, worldtappingcircle.com. Uh, there's a library of videos that can help you learn to tap, tap on different issues, and we meet in a world circle every Monday night at 8 p.m. Central Time uh, and all over the world, uh, tapping together to help us move through these different patterns and bring more of what we deeply desire into our lives. Uh, so I hope to see you there. Loving you, family. Mwah.